everybody, it's Jason with Coffee on the Coast. I'm sitting here with two wonderful guests, uh, two advocates of the community, Tim Gadzinski from the Manitowoc Public Library and Erin Labonte, who is, what, what is your official title? I'm Associate Professor of Art at Silver Lake College of the Holy Family. All right, yeah. sounds good. Erin is an awesome artist and responsible for a lot of the murals you see around town and just the general grooviness of the art scene here in Manitowoc. So is that fair to say? I'm involved in a lot of different, <laughs> different arts like organizations and activities. Yeah, yeah. 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 I've got, I got grooviness going on with the arts here. So, um. so uh, what's going on, guys? We I'm are first. Okay, yeah, I'll, go, I'll go first. <laughs> okay. So, um, Tim has invited me. This will be the second time. I'm really looking forward to it. I will be leading a cork and canvas wine and painting event at the Manitowoc Public Library next Thursday night, not not tomorrow, the next Thursday night, April 25th from 6 to 8 p.m. Cool. Um, yeah. So. And it is uh, a tribute to George O'Keefe, a toast, excuse me, to George O'Keefe. Yeah. And uh, this painting that you see in between Aaron and Jason is the painting that you'll uh, get to reproduce that evening. And Aaron, would you like to tell us a little bit about the painting? Yeah, this painting is called Red Canna. Um, Georgia O'Keeffe painted it in 1924 originally at a much larger scale, um, but she oftentimes uh, took kind of an abstract perspective focused on color um, and explored, um, explored flowers much differently than other artists had in the past. Um, so one thing that I like to add into the, the wine and, and painting events is a little bit of history. So we'll kind of, we'll get into who Georgia O'Keeffe was, uh, she was born in Wisconsin, which is exciting. We have um, one of her pieces at the Royal West Art Museum in town. So she's kind of a great, great artist for us to look into. Also, you know, a strong um, female artist in a time um, when a lot of the art world was more centered around men. So that's kind of an exciting thing too. And I, um, not that not that men aren't invited to the cork and canvas. I encourage, they are. I encourage all <laughs> Everyone is invited to come to the and cork celebrate and canvas. Georgia O'Keeffe. Yes. So uh, a little bit more details. So this is uh, coming up soon. And what are the, what is the cost associated? Is it a fundraiser? What, what what's going on with that? Well, well, anything with the cost associated with it at least is a minor fundraiser. This is a, a small fundraiser for the Friends of Manitowoc Public Library. Excellent. Uh, it costs thirty dollars, and that includes everything: your uh, paints, your brushes, your canvas the tabletop easel. You don't get to take it home, but at least you don't have to paint on a flat surface. Right. And your wine and the lovely Erin Labonte. Yes, and <laughs> I have three assistants who are my um, studio workers at Silver Lake College who will be joining me. So we'll all be bopping around and making sure that everybody's enjoying themselves and feeling comfortable with their paint and canvas. And So I have skills in art, but you have I'm an, anom you have I'm, I'm an art, anomaly but... though. So if somebody doesn't have skills in there, how hard is this to, this looks like a pretty, Yeah. Um, I mean, uh, you take them step by step, is it color by number, is it, how do you, how does one? No, we'll, we'll take it by step, step by step. Um, everybody will be able to see the image that we are, you know, hoping to paint. But one thing that's kind of exciting, and I think that a lot of people maybe don't take time for it in their daily life, is just kind of going with the flow. Um, so, Last last time we did um, Starry Night by Vincent Van Gogh, mm -hmm. and it was everybody's painting was entirely different um, based off just looking at the same subject matter. So I imagine we're going to have some very unique um, renditions of, of the painting, um, and I'm going to encourage people to to play with paint. Yeah, it they feels were all, good. <laughs> the Starry Nights, all of them were great. They were, I mean, yeah. there were 30, not, you know, not paint by number, not cookie cutter versions of Starry Night. Everyone had their own interpretation and I thought it was amazingly cool. And it was everyone from people that were experienced with painting to people that, you know, were saying, oh, I could never do this, I, I, you know, and mm -hmm. they all turned out wonderfully. And it was great to see. And when we're sitting down and choosing the paintings that we're gonna use, we're pretty intentional about it so that it can be an opportunity to mix colors and be kind of playful sure. and abstract at the same time. Sure. Yeah, Very it's cool. a great spring painting too. I mean, it's yeah, just a fun yeah. chance to play with color and shape. Absolutely. Cool. And, you know, to relax 
the wine certainly doesn't hurt. No, and Tim, Tim comes it. around and makes sure that you're full. So it's a, I do my best. Yes, I, I yeah. serve as your host for the Yeah, year. my sister and my and her colleagues were there last time and they just they, they had a great time and they're gonna come back too. So awesome. hopefully yeah, more people awesome. from the community. So you have a great art instructor in Aaron Labonte and the Somalier uh, and Tim Gitzinski for appreciating me for who I am. <laughs> <laughs> and if wow. people want to sign up, they can do it online. That's the easiest okay. way to register. Just head to www.manitowaclibrary.org slash paint. Very cool. And well, that's all your information and you can get it done right away. And the class is filling up. So I encourage everyone to get on it right away. Do it now. All right. Thanks, you guys. Yeah. Well, thank you, know, you for having us. Yeah. yeah. Well, the Manitou I just want to say really quickly, Manitowoc Library is um, above and beyond any library I've seen in other towns. Our, our library is so cool. We do stuff like this in our library, thanks to Tim and, and to uh, community members like Aaron Labonte. That's why they uh, have the awards and all the accolades. So even if you don't go to the, the wine and paint event, make sure you stop in. To the library there's now a coffee bar i just want to plug the library i'm always plugging the library yeah, there's no, now a coffee uh coffee service yeah in there, coffee right? cart there and you guys have a new uh fireplace, fireplace. so it's pretty